What is up guys, Joe here back with another video. Today I wanted to cover how to stake the Avalanche token within Beefy Finance. Currently, Beefy is offering over 30% APY on boosted staking for the Avalanche token. So Beefy is incentivizing you to boost on their platform where you can earn 30% APY versus the regular 9% APR within the Avalanche wallet. And also if you were to stake within the native Avalanche wallet, you do require a minimum of 25 Avalanche tokens to start staking. So this is a great deterrent for anyone who does not have this amount. Within the beefy platform, there is no minimum required. You can stake with a fractional amount of AVAX token. So I'm super bullish on the beefy finance platform and they've been climbing up the ranks with over 1.14 billion in total value locked. And the amazing thing is they have various chains you can yield farm with, including Phantom, Polygon, Kronos, and Harmony One. So today I wanted to cover a complete step-by-step -step guide on how to stake on the beefy finance platform and earn staking rewards. So let's get started. So first thing you will need is the MetaMask wallet. So MetaMask is a Web3 wallet that lives on your browser and on here you can interact with the hundreds of dApps available on the different crypto networks. So the website here would be metamask.io and you would simply click on download and I recommend either using the Chrome or Brave browser and select install metamask for Chrome. It'll bring you to the Chrome web store and it'll have you add the extension to the browser. So once that is installed the shortcut will install on your toolbar section up here with this fox icon and just be sure you back up your seed phrase in a secure location. So by default only the Ethereum blockchain is installed on MetaMask. You're gonna have to manually add the Avalanche network. So the next step here would be adding the Avalanche network to MetaMask which is super simple. You will go to this link that I'll add in the description and on here all you simply have to do is add the network name, the URL, and the chain ID. And from there it'll add the Avalanche network to your MetaMask wallet. And from here you can send and receive your Avalanche tokens. Your address wallet is found here and it begins with a 0x. Cool, now that we have that installed, our next step would be to buy some Avalanche token from Coinbase and send it to the MetaMask wallet. So I'm a big fan of using Coinbase Pro. They do have cheaper fees than the regular Coinbase especially if you're going to be staking and yield farming a lot you want to maintain those purchase fees low and the good thing is the coinbase account links with your regular coinbase account so you can use either platform to your liking again I use coinbase pro because of the lower fees so if you wanted to send the token out of here you would go to the avalanche page and hit withdraw or the same goes as the coinbase page under the avalanche page you would hit send and receive you would select the amount of avalanche token you want to send and under the to section you would paste your avalanche metamask address always be sure you are on the avalanche network so you send it to the right location so back to coinbase pro you would hit withdraw select avalanche crypto address and the to address let's copy our metamask wallet address hit copy here paste it here use this address for amount we're going to select one Great, and there is an associated gas fee. So a gas fee is just a network fee to send a coin from one location to the next. All blockchains have gas fees. This is inherent in all blockchains. It's very minuscule for the Avalanche network. It would only cost you 0 0.01 to send Avalanche tokens across the network. There is a handy website here. You can view different gas fees for the Avalanche network. So something sent fast would cost you 16 cents. Something under normal speed would cost you 0.13 and slow would cost you 12 cents. So very handy. The website here is cointool.app under the Avalanche tab. So let's go ahead and hit withdrawal and verify this on our Google Authenticator app within our iPhone. Withdrawal is started. 
So now let's just keep an eye on our MetaMask here and you should see this populate in a few seconds. Great, and there it is. Our new balance is 1.33 AVAX. I previously had a tiny bit in there, so that's why you see the extra 0.33. But in a few seconds, we managed to get Avalanche in our MetaMask wallet. Cool, our next step would be to connect the MetaMask wallet on the Beefy website. So the website here would be beefy.finance and on the homepage, you do see that it is a multi-chain yield option. Optimizer. So as you can see, they have over a dozen blockchains you can yield farm in and stake. We have Binance Smart Chain, Avalanche, Polygon, Phantom, Harmony One, Cello, Kronos, and Aurora. Cool. So we're going to enter the Avalanche network and right away it's going to ask us to connect to our MetaMask wallet. So that is our next step, connecting to the MetaMask wallet. Click on that. And instantaneous connection, it's connected. So under the Avalanche page, you would scroll lower and the top section here we find the individual token avalanche boosted staking and this is what we're looking for so you click in here and as you can see the boosted staking is using Aave protocol in the background to earn you those high yields so you are earning 30 percent apy versus the normal 10 percent and the amount of total value locked in this pool is over 40 million so a lot of people are staking in this pool currently so now that we found the avalanche token token we're going to want to deposit our avax into the boosted pool so very simply it identifies our metamask wallet we do have 1.33 avax available so you can hit max if you'd like and it'll auto populate the max amount you can stake Cool, so there is a 0% deposit fee and a 0.01% withdrawal fee and the reward token is paid out in Mu Ave AVAX LP token. This acts as your receipt for your deposit. So you will need this receipt when you're ready to withdraw your funds. Keep that in mind, do not lose those LP tokens. And the good thing is the rewards are paid out daily and you don't have to claim the rewards. Beefy Finance claims and manually reinvest and auto compounds the rewards for you. It's an automated process. This is how you're able to earn the boosted 30% APY. So we have a balance of 1.33 AVAX in our MetaMask wallet. I'm gonna go ahead and choose roughly one token. And that way we leave a little extra behind for gas. That's a good tip to keep in mind. Always leave some of that native token behind so you can cover gas fees. And we're gonna go ahead and hit deposit and verify the transaction within MetaMask. And the deposit was successful. Great. Now that we finalized the deposit, you'll start earning the Mu Ave AVAX reward right away. And again, this LP token acts as your receipt. Do not lose it. So now the next question is, what do you do with your rewards? You can either farm this token, this LP token that you're given. You can farm it within Beefy again in a different pool, or you can go to My Finance and begin farming that Mu Ave AVAX token in there. So you're probably wondering, how can I view my LP token? tokens within MetaMask. We don't see it here yet. So what you would do is you can Google search for the Mu Ave AVAX MetaMask address and under the snowtrace.io website, you get the contract address. And from here, you can copy the contract address, hit copy here, go back to MetaMask and under assets, scroll lower and import tokens and token contract address. You would paste this address here and it auto fills the rest of the sections for you and you hit add custom token, import tokens. Great, now it's been successfully added. So now you do see your share of the LP token. You have 1.013 of the Mu Ave AVAX token. Cool, so the next step is we can farm this token, this MMA token under My Finance. So the website here is my.finance and My is similar to MakerDAO or Compound, basically a lending platform or you can use several collateral types to generate their native My stablecoin. For example, you can deposit Avalanche LP tokens, you can deposit Solana tokens, Kronos, and in turn, it'll generate the My stablecoin. The reason is, you're probably wondering why you wanna do that. Essentially, you can double stake your LP tokens and continue earning more rewards on top of that. So we're already earning a yield on the AVAX token, but how can we earn a yield on the Mu AVAX LP token? Easy. Under My Finance, you just enter the app 
and on here you would go to the farm page and you can farm the my token with a different pair there's die my my usdt usdc my there's a few pools that you can contribute to another option for you would be to actually just do nothing you can just let the rewards collect passively within beefy you don't necessarily have to continue chasing higher yields you can just leave it here set it and forget it beefy will auto compound the rewards for you amazing so when you're ready to pull out your funds to so keep in mind this boosted staking is a limited promotional offer i expect this boosted staking to only last a month or two and eventually the reward rate will begin to fall lower so just keep an eye out on it it'll eventually reach back to its normal state of 10 percent but when that happens you can pull your avax token out and find a different pool you can contribute to when you're ready to cash out or pull out your funds, you can follow the same steps, but in a backward sequence. So if you're yield farming on my, you would obviously have to pull your collateral out of here, pull out your LP tokens and go back to the AVAX pool and withdraw the LP tokens from here and redeem your Mu Ave AVAX here. Great. And that just about covers it. A step-by-step -step complete guide on how to stake avalanche on beefy finance i'm super bullish on the platform and they keep climbing up the ranks and more and more investors are piling into this name it's a super easy interface to use and it actually works it's audited it's secure and it has some of the highest yields in the industry so let me know what you think about beefy are you a fan do you like their interface what do you think about avalanche let me know in the comment section so i hope you found this information helpful if you have any questions please leave a question in the comment section I'll be happy to respond. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one.